Hey guys, it's me Chanel here, and I am doing a magic trick video for you guys today. Now, I have set up three magic tricks that everybody can learn. It's very simple. You can do it at any time. At school, at your job, whatever. Okay, so I just woke up like a couple hours ago, and I'm going to do the magic tricks for you guys. Okay. The first one... Um, is originally supposed to be with the dollar bill, but I don't have any dollar bills, and I can't, and for this magic trick, like, I have to use a dollar bill, but I don't have any. So, I'm going to poke a hole through this paper, this one, without touching this paper. So you see the pencil is inside it, right? Pencil is inside it. See the pencils inside it? Now I'm going to poke a hole through the paper. Oh no, that was so bad, that was so bad, that was so bad. But, when I take the paper out, no hole. So, you guys comment below for all these three magic tricks, how I do it. No, actually don't comment below, because I'm going to reveal how to do the magic tricks. Okay, so for this magic trick, what you have to do is have to put a little hole through here. Now that's why I didn't want to use the dollar bill, because you can't damage U.S. property. You can't, like, group dollar bills, so I just made a hole. It's very easy to make the hole. You just put, you just make the paper go in half like this, and you just, um, tear a piece like that. Okay. So, what and then what you do is you show you sh if you're doing it to somebody, you show them this side, not the back side. Cause if if you if you let them see the back side, they're gonna see this. They're gonna see this hole. So you gotta show them it, it like to them like this, and then you're gonna poke the hole through it. But you're going to make it so that it goes, this is how it's supposed to look. I don't know if you guys can see, but that's how it's supposed to look. The pencil is going through this, so yeah. And that is how you do that trick. Moving on to our next trick, I'll see you guys in a minute. Wow. Hey guys, I'm back, and here is the next magic trick. It's originally supposed to be with dollar bills too, but I didn't have any. So this magic trick is supposed to be called money through money, but I'm going to turn it around and call it paper through paper. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this, I'm going to put this piece of paper, and it's, I'm going to make this piece of paper go behind I'm going to make this piece of paper go behind me. Ready, set. It's behind it. See, guys? It's behind. Now I'm going to make it go in the middle of it. It's in the middle. Now I'm going to make it go through it. I made it go through it, guys. See? Regular piece of paper, no cuts, no holes, no nothing. This is also a regular piece of paper, no, cut, no cuts, no holes, no nothing. So, I'm going to show you guys how to do trick in a minute. So, bar. Okay, guys, I'm back. Sorry. Now I'm going to show you how to do the trick. You have to fold this paper in half. Now, this paper is very um, light. So you guys might, probably can't see it. Let me just turn it to the side to fold this paper like that. And then I don't know why um, I don't know why people put it right here because it doesn't it doesn't look like natural. So I like to put it at the back right here. It looks more natural. So to so it's really simple. You just make it, um, just turn the doll, I mean, sorry, just turn the paper up to make it go behind it, and then to make it go 
through to make it go in between it, just set the dollar, set the bill or paper down. Now, what you don't want to do, like I do it this way, what you don't want to do is expose too much of it. Because if you expose too much of it, then that, they'll see the trick. They'll see the secret behind the trick. And all you do when you're going to make the paper go through it is you're just going to do it really fast so they don't suspect a the thing. They think it was all natural. Now for the next trick. It's the last trick ever, guys, okay? So I'll be right back. Oh. Okay, guys, I'm back, and this is the last trick. It's very simple. Uh, this is how to tie your shoes in three seconds. Okay, the first thing you're going to do is you're going to make sure that you put your index finger behind the shoelace, So and then... Make put your index finger behind the shoelace, make it go inside, and put your thumb right next to it like this. Now you're gonna now you're gonna do it to the other, but you're gonna do it opposite. You're gonna put your thumb right in front of right in front of the shoelace, making it go like that. Now what you're gonna do is you're just gonna pull these together tightly, like that, so you can tie your shoe. And guys, that's how you do the last night trick. Please comment below, share, and, you know, make new videos on how you guys do it. So, peace, guys. Um, CK out.